seeing guys that can't believe they finally won. Guys that have been at it a long time. Guys that have been at it just a few years. But they are together, Stanley Cup champions. the cup come out uh, jealousy but also to see who's gonna get to hold the thing over their head first well what a playoff story and the exclamation mark collecting the cup as the alternate captain Ray he was brilliant leading the team in points well there's different ways to lead and some do it in the room by being a commanding presence others do it on the ice by being a physical player. He does it by providing offense. Time and time again, they look to him. Oh, look at this moment here, Ray. He's finally done it. I think every hockey fan is happy for him here. I'm sure there were many times where he started to wonder, could this ever happen? Or is the sand going to run out before I get a chance? Look at how happy he is. Well, look who's getting a chance to hoist the cup. It was a brick wall for the last two months, Ray. Well, you can't win without goaltending. I mean, think of the last team that won with shaky goaltending. He's always the most important player on the team. He gets the con Smythe, and now he gets to roll with the Stanley Cup. Ray from simply trying to make the team to being an absolute rocking goal, and now he's hoisting the cup. Well, no team's going to win without goaltending, and when you have a rookie in goal, that means you've got a little bit of question coming into the playoffs about how they're going to handle it all. Question answered. And as they gather for the team photo, there are your Stanley Cup champions. This is the emotional picture, the one with the cup for the first time. The polished one will be in a couple of days when everybody's shaved their beards and combed their hair.